I received a phone call from the commander of my Korean War Veterans chapter, Monroe County, and he said, Betty, I received some pictures from a lady whose dad was in Korea. They were just beautiful, eight by 10, black and white glossy. And the minute you look at them, you realize there's so many family members behind each picture. And how do we get this to them? About two years ago, I saw a story on a local news station of a woman who had a beautiful collection of photos from the Korean War. And she was trying to match faces to families. During the video, I saw just a flash of a photo and uh, what I thought was my grandfather. And I thought, there's really no way it could be him. That would just be too much of a coincidence. But I, I did end up contacting Betty and um, came to her house with some of my own photos. And then I laid my photo down beside it. I knew right away it was him. But from this photo, you know, I found out more about how my grandparents met when he was in the Korean War. He was then stationed in Japan where my grandmother worked. Having that photo, it's just, it's like having a piece of him back. Once I took the photo home and um, I was still in disbelief that I, I had this photo and it was actually a match. I, you know, I thought, well, we, we got to get these photos out to the rest of the world. How can we, how can we do that? And of course, getting them online for the world to see was the answer. But then the thought of there's so many of them that how would we, how would we do that? Once we heard about the Korean War photos, I got excited and so did my colleagues. Our eyes, eyes lit up because we knew we could build a, a website that could showcase these photos and get them out in front of the public. Kodak Alaris had already scanned the photos and they were able to provide us high quality digital files to begin building a website around. The images are pristine black and white images, but on the back, each of the photos have a caption with the date and the place and names. And that capturing that information was just equally as important as capturing that image. And Kodak Alaris was able to do that with their technology. And one of our goals was to make this website searchable. So to be able to capture that caption information as well um, through use of their optical character recognition software was a big plus too. I knew that they needed to be handled with care. And so when we took them to Kodak Alaris and put them through the scanner, um, they were scanned in a matter of seconds. We don't have to slow down just because you're scanning both sides at the same time. We, we keep the scanner at the full rated speed when doing either single-sided or both sides at the same time. Partnering with Kodak Alaris allowed us to move the timeline on this project along very quickly. If we had had to scan each of these photos individually, and what we're used to using is a flatbed scanner, it would have taken a very long time. I'm not even sure if we would have been able to commit that kind of time to this project to be able to scan them individually. I'm most excited to know that these photos are out there for the world to see and that another family could have the same experience that I had and possibly learn more about their loved one and share the word with other people, share the link and any veteran you know, your neighbor, pass it along. And we're all in our 80s, so uh, it's really imperative, I feel, that we find these people as soon as possible and let them enjoy those pictures.